Hey guys, it's me again. Um, so I've been getting a lot of comments and emails and messages about York. Now, for those of you who don't know yet, I graduated this year. Um, so I'm not there anymore. I'm actually back near Ottawa, um, back at my parents' house. Um, it's a little town, it's Smith Falls in case any of you want to know. You probably don't even know where it is. Regardless. Um, I'm still a fountain of information as far as York, but especially Glendon goes. So, I've noticed that a lot of you are looking at the York, my York dorm, and York dorm info and videos that I've posted. So, if any of you want to know any more information or have questions about first year, what you should be bringing in your dorm, um, suggestions on appliances you should be bringing and what you shouldn't be bringing, because <laughs> I know it comes with a list of things that are illegal, but there are a few tips and tricks that I can give you as far as what to bring that is kind of legal but kind of not and would be really, really helpful in the dorm. Trust me, I lived there for five years, I'm pretty much an expert on the subject. Um, I could also offer information about classes or professors. Um, I was a history and drama major with an undeclared English minor. So I have a pretty uh, good range of knowledge as far as classes goes. Um, I can tell you stuff about student services, uh, financial aid, liaison, jobs on campus, stuff like all that. I I like to think of myself as a little mini expert. <laughs> Um, and I know that there's not a lot of videos out there about this kind of stuff, especially for Glennon. It is a really small campus, and people don't think to post this kind of stuff. I know there was nothing like this when I went there, or when I started, so I'm sure I could help out any of you guys. Um, and I know when I, when I first started out, my first year, I didn't get to see Glennon until I had already enrolled, and, in, and, uh, accepted everything. I didn't get to see Glennon until I went for my first campus tour which wasn't until about July um, so if any of you are in that boat I totally understand and I know that some of you won't even be able to see the campus until uh, August at Frosh Week which is another thing I can fill you in on if you have any questions about Frosh Week I can definitely give you some lowdowns on uh, Frosh Week wow side note my eyes look really really weird because of this lighting <laughs> yes PS this is in my room um, pink wall woohoo uh, so yeah, I mean, like I said, I am graduated, but that doesn't mean that my knowledge is gone. So please feel free to ask. I can make videos or email you about the information. I am going to make a quick video in a few minutes about what to be bringing to your dorm. Uh, it, it'll be super, super helpful for all you first years, um, and I can definitely give you some tips and ideas. All right, see you guys soon.